hands up if you like wearing black. Actually, I may just put two hands up because I wear black all the time before I had my colours done. And I'll tell you why. Because I thought black was the safe option. I thought black made me feel my best. I thought it was very, very slimming and flattering. But boy, was I wrong because when are you wearing black? it's going to hide your features unless you're in the winter season black can be one of them things where we think it's really flattering it's a safe easy option but i can tell you now if you wear black every day like i used to you're going to feel really boring you're going to feel like every day you go into a wardrobe it's a sea of black and you just haven't got anything that you really enjoy wearing anymore because you're so used to wearing the same colour day in and day out. I'm going to show you a few simple steps which might motivate you to get your colours done and show you how much more uplifting it's going to do. But step number one is get rid of the black. So I've just put this on over me now and I can tell you already, when I bring this down, you can see already how much more visible I look. I have this lovely blue tone colour on. I love wearing blue. If you prefer to wear darker colours, then wear a darker colour in your season. Let's put it this way. You can see already how much more my eyes stand out now with the blue tone than when the black was there. Let me quickly grab it. It's there. Can you see the face? It looks really, really washed out. It doesn't do much for me. As soon as I bring the blue back, you can see already how much more uplifting that looks. And I just feel so much better already doing the blue. But there's something else that's missing. When I have the blue tone on, how can I take it to that extra smile? And let me tell you how. Learn your best colours in your colour analysis season. And also, use complementary colours or colours that work really, really well together. So I'm about to put on a colour of this that's going to really, really give it the pop that it needs. Let me show you now. So, as you can see straight away, I have now done my red lipstick in my best red, which is a warmy orangey tone, and then my favourite blue top. And I am now ready and feel so much better in a space of literally 20, 30 seconds. I just feel so much better than when I had the black on. You can see already how much more visible I look. And this is what I want you to feel like. I want you to feel visible. I want you to get excited in the morning. This top's actually from Bowden. It fits really, really well. I love the V-neck effect to it. I'm so, so excited um, to share this with you because I really hope that this has inspired some of you to ditch the black. And I want to give you a little bit of a task. If you're watching this, I want to challenge you to wear a colour that you've never worn before. I want you to go out or online, try and find a colour that you know that works really well for you, put it on, wear it, and you'll see already that how much more uplifted that makes you feel. Colour psychology is a real thing. So colour has a massive thing and a massive impact on our moods. So when you're wearing things like black, that's quite dull and draining. But when as soon as you put on like a yellow or an orange or blue, it's going to make you feel a lot, lot better. So yeah, I'm hoping this video has really inspired some of you. I'm really, really loving the blue and red together. I've got so many different tops in these colours from Bowdoin. So I've actually got a green one as well. And I know that green works well with pink. So I might wear my green top and my pinky tone lipstick. You don't always have to wear a lipstick or a lip balm with your colour. But I really feel like when you pop the two it can really really make a huge difference look at how my features are standing out my eyes look a lot more bolder now with the red tone so that's complementing the greeny tone for the red and then the red is complementing the blue so it all works really really nicely if you want your colors done i offer consultations worldwide so there's no limit to my services if you are in australia or america or if you're another part of the uk definitely get in touch and I'll help you learn your best colours. I want to push you outside your comfort zone as much as you can so that you enjoy getting ready every day and also you go to your wardrobe and you look at it and think I love everything in here and I can't wait to get dressed every day and that is exactly what how I want you to feel. Ditch the black, do um, the task that I recommend and show me your pictures below on any sort of colours that you decide to wear. Um, I'm just so, so excited to motivate as many of you as possible and I really, really hope that this is the best time to do it. Go for your wardrobes, find the colours that make you feel good, wear them. Some of you might have items in there that you've bought and that you haven't worn before. Try and really reshop your wardrobe before anything else. If you haven't got anything in the colour that you love or really like, Get an accessory, it's a lot more affordable, like a scarf or earrings or even your favourite lipstick or lip balm. That's going to really, really help you. 
The Kapow colour is amazing. Yellow will make you feel really vibrant and happy. Orange is a really warm and friendly colour. Blue is a very trustworthy colour. A lot of people wear it in the corporate world as well. Um, green is a very calming colour. So when you think of green, look at green, you think of nature. There's so many different um, meanings behind colour. And I'm going to do more videos on that as well in the future. So I hope you've enjoyed this. And I hope you've loved seeing the brighter tone colours. Let me know if you enjoyed these sort of videos. And I will do some more for you.